Now here is Erwin's Honda Civic SIR. The Honda Civic SIR in the Philippines is the only Civic that has a B16A. So this one is a really, really cool car, but look at this, look close. H3 Auto Works is well maintained by H3 Auto Works. It's due for rebuild, so I decided to get a B20 block. So we'll do a B20 VTEC as a street car, a stock EG car, as if Honda made a 2 liter SIR. So this is going to be interesting. We're going to disassemble the B20 now, inspect everything with you guys, see what we can find, and make sure everything is good. And yes, we're going to calculate compression because it has a PHK pistons. And of course, we'll talk about the parts, the place where we get our parts. Yes, so you know this one is is for you all right first things first here's a new facebook page i had to make a new one because i lost control of the old page when I, my personal facebook got hacked here we got prices there of head porting android rebuild labor even ec tuning basically all the stuff that we're going to do in this video is the price list is on the page so yes we are trying to constantly post good stuff on the page that can lead to a good discussion like this on the intake it led to a intake test so because the comments were really interesting is giving us more ideas so we decided to do an intake test for that and you know you gotta check out the page link will be in the description if you don't have facebook we got our instagram is quite active too i must do the same post all the stuff that we do at the shop that doesn't always make it the, the content so if you don't have facebook Link will be in the description below for Instagram, follow us. And for short form content, our TikTok is quite active, as you can see here, three of my guitar videos. I also post good stuff for good entertainment. So all three links will be in the description below. So check it out, right? Okay, yep, here it is. Here's Erwin's Civic SIR. It's actually bone stock. So that's pretty interesting and cool because it gives a bit good value to the car because much of most of the local SIRs are, have been modded so this one is bone stock and it's due for rebuild so look it's been maintained by HG Auto Works way back when Bob was still alive and I'm from H3 so this is interesting yes so now we're going to disassemble the surplus block that he got he actually got it from Kanzai so it's pretty decent so we're going to check if everything checks out good then we can proceed to doing the build like the resurfacing and honing because look the deck look, looks pretty decent right yep so this will be interesting and of course we'll also discuss about the stuff that we will do to make this even more efficient like we'll port the head but before we continue i need a favor you gotta hit the like button because the more the, vid the likes the video gets the more activity it shows with the algorithm that shows more activity so you know it gets boosted up to a wider audience and that helps the channel big time so i really appreciate that guys and if you haven't of course you gotta subscribe this way you, you can watch all the other videos on your own free time because whenever you log into youtube you'll check out all the stuff instead of searching it and you will notice if we have a new upload you'll definitely see it right away right so you subscribe so i'll see you there okay and of course for the hardcore we got the members only here you can join the members only on the section in here in youtube you got ultra technical videos there of even dyno tuning and everything so all the good stuff and it gets boring but you know it's good for the hardcore so yep here now let my colleague disassemble the engine here getting the oil pump off all the good stuff in the oil pan we just drained the oil earlier so it's kind of brown but you know it looks decent you know it looks like nothing is abnormal nothing looks like it's it was changed and you know everything looks pretty decent it looks this decent for a um, high mileage engine so that's good you know yep and now it's turned by hand let me show you the crank oh yeah it turns really decent so you know we know the crank is not bent there's nothing wrong with it so after checking the clearances with the new bearings this will be really really good it will be ready to rumble oh yeah and my colleague checked all the pistons everything checked out fine so it will just need cleaning and of course new piston rings that'll be all good and of course the rod bearings and yes, this will definitely need ARP rod bolts because it's going to be VTEX. It's going to be running, revving a little bit higher. A stock CRV probably revs around 6.8 or 6.4. And a stock B16, even though this has EG cams, it still revs around 8, 
two or eight floors so that needs eip rod bolts let's calculate the compression here because the b20 v tech is a late model it has phk pistons so here the block and crank is good b16a head here's phk pistons let's get the rods to the b20 yes okay so now let's calculate it look at it there all right let's see Okay, so it's 10 is to 1. But of course, we got to resurface the head and block a minimal amount. So it'll total to 0 0.010 or 1 fourth millimeter just to make sure everything is flat. Compute. 10.26. Oh, that's pretty good because, you know, a stock B16A EG from an SIR has about 10.28 is to 1 conversion. So around 10.3. And this has 10.26. That's identical. So this will definitely run on unleaded pump gas, no problem, all right? Here, we're gonna get the bearings, belt, even head gasket from HRC. Here's their page. It's They've been open since 2000, so for 25 years, they've been good. They, they've been our source, me and Bong, back when he was still alive. So this is a good place. So if you're local and you, you need some parts, this is a safe place because they're not gonna ruin their name by selling fake parts. They always have authentic, genuine Honda parts. So you're always safe getting there. And of course, for the aftermarket stuff like this, for ARP rod bolts, we always get it from downshift supply. Carlo is a good guy. He always carries good stuff like ERP rod bolts, even head studs. And you can see here, let's look at the pictures of the stuff they have. They also do maintenance in Marikina. Their shop is in Marikina. So if you need maintenance stuff, bring your car to them. You got to check their page for their address. Look, yeah, they, they have cam gears, rotor wheels. We actually get the one twin cam gears from them all the time, even coilovers. So check their page. Link will be in the description below. Carlo is a good guy to talk to, to deal with. He's quite honest. And of course, they always supply good stuff. So check it out. All right. Here's the block. And the earlier, this, this, it was still a deer. I still has the pistons. The deck, deck checked out good, but of course, we're going to resurface this, so it's going to be even more flat, just to make sure it's clean. And of course, we know after honing, that's the only time we're going to clean up the engine. So, it, I mean, the block, so it's going to be cleaner, it, it won't get rust. And around sometime around next week, Erwin is going to bring his SIR, because he still uses it for work. Then we're going to disassemble the head, port it, even the intake manifold, and as soon as everything is done, yes, you know it, you can always click it over here.